WKYC.com. From the WKYC Digital Broadcast Center, this is Channel 3 News. Help could be on the way for residents. Saturday in 86. Maureen? All right, Bruce, thanks. The Case Western Reserve University Midwife Program just celebrated its 25th graduating class of new nurse midwives. CWRU's program is one of the top ranked midwifery programs in the country, and it's right here in our backyard. And here today is Gretchen Mettler, director of the school's program. Gretchen, thank you so much for being here today. Thank you so much for having me, Maureen. Well, it's a pleasure, and I want to get right to it because I've heard the term midwife but what is the difference between a nurse midwife and maybe somebody that we would regularly see in a doctor's office? That's a great question. Nurse midwives are registered nurses who have a master's degree in nursing that has taught them how to become a midwife. We work collaboratively with physicians and um, we practice mostly in hospitals. We're doing about 11 percent of the births in the United States now and only one percent of births happen at home so you can see that the vast majority of what we do happens in hospitals. Okay, now what, um, why would maybe somebody who's expecting, why would they choose a midwife as that option, as that right. delivery option? We work to um, empower women to have the birth experience, the pregnancy experience that they dream of. Mm -hmm. So um, we do individualized woman-centered care. We're generally with the woman throughout her labor and we're not just rushing in at the end to catch the baby. Um, we try to understand what it is that the woman is interested in achieving for her pregnancy and her labor and birth. So what are some of the different options that, that somebody who is expecting, you know, what could a midwife help with? A midwife can help with good nutrition, encourage exercise, a healthy lifestyle overall. Um, in labor, um, midwives offer women many options including water birth, um, epidurals and other kinds of pain medication um, or natural childbirth of any variety mm -hmm. and um, and then for birth we often do birth in different positions not just lying flat on the back mm -hmm. and we also take care of women throughout their lifespan so we do family planning mm -hmm. and we do um, gynecologic health as well as menopause health. I was going to ask, it's not just it's not just babies. <laughs> no, people think that all we do are pregnancy and labor and birth, but we actually cover the whole lifespan from um, sexually transmitted disease, infection, um, diagnosis and treatment, and normal stuff, normal gynecologic family planning, through bone health and um, understanding is a woman getting enough calcium and vitamin D to maintain her bone health in, in menopause. And just briefly, if somebody would want to find a midwife, what's the first step? The first step would be to go to the web, to mm -hmm. midwife.org. Uh, if somebody locally is interested, they could call their local hospital and find out from their labor and delivery unit if there are midwives that work there. Or they could um, call their insurance provider and find out what midwives are on their insurance panels. All right, Gretchen, great information. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you for having me. Well, still come this midday if you're still hungry after.